Okay, we've got the shaft in the machine. First thing I'm going to do, as you can see, I've already taken the tip off. I'm just going to go ahead and face this off a little bit. Now what we've got, this is the snapshot, three quarter inch, 11.75 OD tungsten ferrule. So what we're going to do is just cut this ferrule down to the ID of the snapshot ferrule. So it's going to take a little bit of, little bit of time back and forth to bring that down. So let's go ahead and get started with that. I know the first little bit is going to take quite a bit off of it. And every time I make a pass, I check it. No, we're, we're not that far off, so I'm going to come in maybe two thousandths, maybe two more thousandths, maybe two more thousandths, right there on the end. And let's see how close we are. We've got a ways to go yet. So I'm going to come in about another five thousandths, and another five, and then I'll check it. We're close. We don't want to go too far. Come in another five and another five. Check it again. Not that far. Let's see where we're at. Boy, we are almost exactly there. So I'm going to back it off one two thousandths, and we're going to go ahead and cut it all the way back, all the way back to the shoulder. Test it again. Very, very close. I'm just going to take a hair off of it. Half a mil, half a mil, uh, half of a thousand. And I'm going to square up the shoulder. Nice and square. Let's see what we've got. Oh, needs to come a little bit more. I'm going to make it snug, but not, not too tight. Look at that. Perfect. I've got it there, I'm just going to go ahead and face this off. Get rid of that old you know, wood dowel, there it is. Wood tenon, that's what we want. All right, next up I'm going to take this ferrule off, I'm going to mix some two-part epoxy, and then I'm going to glue it and let it set. Next video we'll be putting the tip on, and the next step after that we'll be tapering the shaft.